A man accused of concealing the death of a Johns Creek teenager is now in custody. Johns Creek police say 25 year old Sean Salim turned himself in yesterday, but his connection to Carly Jackson is still unclear. The 16 year old Johns Creek High School cheerleader died on Valentine's Day. A friend told police she found Jackson unresponsive inside a home after hanging out with her the night before. Police have not yet said how Jackson died. New this morning, the Southern Baptist Convention has ousted a church in Kennesaw for being too inclusive of the LGBTQ community. Townview Baptist Church has been disfellowshipped following a decision at an executive committee meeting. In all, the committee deciding to disfellowship four churches, two for policies that it says are too inclusive of those in the LGBTQ community, and two more for employing pastors convicted of sex offenses. Ahmad Aubrey's mother filing a federal lawsuit on the one-year anniversary of his death. In it, she accuses the three white men charged with murdering her son of violating his constitutional rights, first in a racially motivated murder, then in a cover-up by law enforcement. A father and son, Gregory and Travis McMichael, are both accused of chasing Aubrey down as he was jogging in a Brunswick neighborhood and killing him. William Bryan is accused of following behind and filming the shooting. Months later, that video drew widespread outrage when it leaked. No trial dates have been set.